So I wanted to share a little experiment about power filtration. I guess surge protection is pretty easy to quantify. Sometimes you can just look at the outside of the box of the surge board and make a comparison just using the specifications between products. What's a lot more difficult is power filtration. There's some products that really claim to have power filtration, but difficult to, to show you what power filtration really does. So meet my friend the little Belkin noise sniffer. It essentially takes any electrical noise in a circuit and turns it into something audible to help us measure it. So plugging our little noise sniffer into the socket, turning it on, and you can clearly hear that sound is the electrical noise in the circuit being turned into an audible output. Now that might come from lights that are on the same circuit, compressors that are on a nearby circuit, but you can really hear the noise that's coming through that at the moment. So the first board, while seemingly a good power board, doesn't mention anything about filtration. Let's have a look what happens when we plug in the noise sniffer. So really no difference to plugging it directly into the wall socket that we did earlier, unfortunately. So the second board we've got does claim to have surge filtration. Interesting to see if it makes much difference to the uh, noise sniffer's output. So there is a very small change, but certainly not filtering the circuit enough to do away with any of the noise that we might experience. This is another board, popular brand. Let's see how the test goes on it. In fact, uh, it, it almost made the, uh, the filtration worse. So big brand, widely available. Um, you know, again, I just caution people to, to make sure that they know the difference between surge protection, filtration, and, uh, and buy appropriately. Maximum noise. So this is the uh, Thor Smartboard A12. Now, they've got a patented system on there called Dynamic Active Tracking. And I think you'd be surprised at the result compared to the other boards. So absolutely nothing coming through. Even at the board's maximum sensitivity, there's absolutely not a squeak that comes through, which uh, you know, to me is pretty amazing compared to the other boards. So uh, I really hope you found that useful. The little experiment was really important for our, our business and uh, I suppose our staff to understand filtration. And you know, from it, I guess, there's really only one board that we can recommend. That's the little smart board and all of our customers will be getting that from now on.